Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sherry Fat and I live in Nova Scotia in Canada. On my YouTube channel, I just share my experiences about life here in Canada. I also do a bit of immigration because I'm a regulated Canadian immigration consultant and RCIC. But I do more mainly, mainly lifestyle videos actually. Anyways, in this video, I'll be taking you through a party we attended in a couple of weeks ago. Uh, come with us i'm so happy that in nova scotia like things are looking up like this party like back to when we came in 2016 if you had told me that something like this would be happening in nova scotia i would say you know it's not possible now people are getting all doing parties there's dj there's nigerian food there's you know like papa obambe really nice anyway come with me on this just a like a very fun video you know and see how all we got to do and you know i was really happy to go to this event i'm sure you can see from the video as you watch i was just excited i was in a very happy mood i would say and i just liked it and the truth the thing is for during summer there's always like a lot of parties like almost every like in fact every weekend there's always one event we go for i mean i may not video everything and you know show everything because it's not everybody the event i go to and you know start to you know record and all of that but the few ones I'm able to, like, I'm in the mood to record, I'll bring it to you so you can see, like, every weekend, almost every weekend, if I every weekend now, for the past couple of weeks. If I, there was one that ah, I missed, that really, really pinned me. My husband was in Nigeria then, it was a birthday party. The pa the celebrants, I bet the husband and the celebrants, in fact, all set people in the hotel, like, paid hotel money for people to come. The party was in Halifax, so, but the owner of the party and the husband, took people the guests in the hotel overnight it pained me because Mzan was not in nigeria was was in nigeria at the time and it was during ramadan so for those two reasons i couldn't really go so even if even if it was around it was ramadan i don't think we would have gone and if it was not ramadan i wouldn't have been able to go go alone for such party uh like that anyway enjoy this particular video enjoy and let me add that this particular event, it was my husband that got the invitation. I mean, for both of us, but he's more friends with the lady than I am. But for some reason, I was more in a happy, like, more in a party mood than the person that they even invited. I was asking, ah, you did that took me to this, you that told me that somebody gave you invitation. By now, you know, not in a high spirit. I had something happened that day, my mom was not in a good mood, something like happened. But you see, I mean... Even if something happens to me, like, especially if it's not something I can undo, right? I really don't allow you to weigh me down. We are different, I know, but I just don't allow things I have no control over, like, to spoil my mood or to weigh me down. If you get what I mean? Like, I can be going through the worst of the worst right now, and I will smiling. You know, but I wouldn't know. But if you know, you'd be like, ah, she get your kid, you know, like, can't this get, you know, being a, like, I really don't dwell on, on bad things. Like, I really don't allow things to weigh me down. I don't allow people or things I have, con I don't have control over, you know, weigh me down. You get what I mean? Anyway, that's, I am, I can be like, so people always say, oh, you're always happy, you're always, nah. <laughs> Most sometimes I'm like not in a good mood. Sometimes there are things I'm struggling with, I'm going through. But I just think that you know, carrying your problem on your face will do you little good, actually. Anyways, enough of my enough of my rambling. Enjoy. And let me also add that this party, you got the invite like a month or two before. So when it sent it to me, I'm like, ah, this person gave you like enough enough notice, so like like we got the invites way 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 before the event anyway enjoy <laughs> And as for the fine girl that I am, I had to take pictures before they leave in the house because <laughs> why not? Singing now. <laughs> Said where I was popping. Anyways, I took pictures at home. Even though my husband was already saying, let us go. We're already running leave. We're already lit. The party was for four. I think it was at around five or something. My husband went somewhere and then he got back, dressed up. So I was already dancing, saying, let us go, let us go. I'm like, this picture, I must take it. <laughs> Can I come and take the picture when I come back? Because wake up would have gone away. I took them again in the pink in the car because why not? If not. Yeah. 
The first person we saw at the about the entrance was also going in. It's one of my friends in Halifax, Demi Dayo. She's also a YouTuber. I'll put her name on the screen. Go check her out. So you took pictures, personal pictures together with her and also with my husband as well. Because why not? The opportunity for me to take pictures with him before we went, went into the hall because kind of sometimes vain as you can already tell by now yep is it this way okay I want to I I told I, I asked you to be hot and break a leg, and you did. Yeah, you yeah, know. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Much so, me see the efficiency woman <laughs> organizer to bar awesome girl. You have energy, I know. I'll actually talk about Tommy. Tommy is an awesome person. The first day I met her, I think we met each other for a long time. And I And I met another of my darling friends at the party. A uh, fun fact about this, my friend, we have many mutual friends together, like back in Nigeria. We never knew ourselves in Nigeria, but we, we, we happen to know many people together. My friends that we lived in Sule together, my friends that we had any the same secondary school together, she knows them. So, uh, you're, you're so funny. And those are husbands behind us for the bombing our pictures. Sorry.
I'll come. I'll branch. I'll even sit together. <laughs> like, what Amala? Amala. Hey, this is Nigeria. Oh. Oh. Hey, this is, this is Nigeria. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That puts it up for cooking. That puts it. I'm the manager. I'll share with my husband. I'll eat my husband. I'm a big manager. Hello everyone, again, my name is Amok and uh, I met Tony Finn. I'm just like it myself. That's me. And I really want to appreciate everyone for your support. You know? Another of my friend in Halifax. We've been colleagues twice in different organizations. I met her at a party as well. <laughs>
see as if the decorator saw what i was wearing and <laughs> decided to decorate the all with the colors i wore it was really beautiful the chair covers the decoration everything was really really nice so like if for somebody to help you with that halifax event and gifts is your plug in halifax <laughs> a beautiful celebrant there it was a very beautiful and fun uh by the party i enjoyed myself thanks for having us wish you many more years by god's grace <laughs> Come here. Me ready. Ryan. Eh? You want me to do what I'm doing? Yeah? You want me to do that? Hey. You guys are ready. We are. We are. Ma. Hey. Hey. Ben. Hey. Eh, this is my life. Oh, my My legs. <laughs> yeah. I don't joke as in as a profession. She knows you. I'm a baby pastor, mother, because I'm more.